the majority of them. <coughs> I'm not oh, used no. to doing other people's videos. Okay. Yeah. You're in well, charge. hello and welcome back <laughs> to the Wee Savage Muses. And look who's here with me today. Are you alright, Simon? Oh, yeah. This I'm is... Simon Savage of Savage Reads. You are? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> should, have, should have said, kind mm. of assumed. Um, so, if you've been watching Simon's channel, you'll know that recently um, I picked 12 prompts for the next 12 months to read because we're not going to do book hibernation this year. We thought we'd do something different. So, I have my 12 literary prompts in month order. There was 24 potentials, wasn't there? Because we didn't yes. want it to be too obvious. That's right. So there's 24 in the jar and um, Simon is now going to pick 12 of the lovely prompts. <laughs> I was nice with mine and actually I think you got the harshest one in that one. I think I'm... I thought you were saying lovely in a slightly sinister way. Well, I'm only trying to worry you a bit. Okay, so you were yeah, being sinister. I want, I want you, you know, let's I want to clarify, adrenaline. Let's clarify, you're being sinister. It's got to be video gold. <laughs> Sinister Savage. Sinister Savage. Anyway, I think he's about to choose his 12. I'm hoping I am. so. So we're going what, through month's order. Just before you do, though, what did yeah. you think was the meanest? The read 500 pages. Oh, no. I, there was I, one like really good one in there that I wish you'd got that was quite quite sad you didn't. Oh. Because it was to go to an independent bookshop and buy a book that day uh, and start reading it. Uh, but there's always more prompts if you get bored. You should bored. have got that in 10 times. <laughs> Can you imagine if you'd got that every month? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, Ooh, so January. Now, I thought I had an idea of how I was going to do that. That one's calling to me. Oh, yeah, you said. What were you going to well, do? Well, not go from the top straight away because that's a bit. No, I didn't. I no, I shouldn't didn't do that. Do so, that. January, I am going to, which is very soon. Yes. Where the protagonist has at least one of your names. I. That's in yours. Is it? <laughs> well, not as it was, it was an option. Okay. To read a book with. So, does that mean it has to be. There is a book called Send Simon Savage. It's spelled wrong, though. Oh, yeah. It's a way, but... Yeah, no. So, can that be Simon or... Yeah. Or David? Yeah, it says one, at least one on. Oh. And you've yeah. got four to go for. I have got four. <laughs> I'm very, very greedy. Very greedy. Right, now I'm going to go for one from the top. February. Featuring a bird slash birds. Yes. Now, is that on the cover or in it? In it. In it. Yes. Not Featuring. Not a talking one, though. No, it doesn't have to be a talking bird. Okay, that's... How am I going to do this that way? Because you like birds. I don't know if anyone knows you're a bit of a twitcher. Well, not a twitcher anymore. I know oh, you have a pet. Everyone probably knows me. I have a pet duck. Yes, but we went for a walk on Christmas Day and there was definitely twitching going on. But that's twitching from... Is it a moorhen or a coot? From, oh, that's easy. If it's got a white beak, it's a coot. And if it's got a red beak, it's a moorhen. You say it's easy, but you right, can teach me that for about 35 years. <laughs> March, when I shall turn 40. Oh, I quite like this one. This is very me. With a creepy title. Yes. <laughs> so that's what... I like that. That's nice. Thank you. Didn't you like the other two then? I did, although I will notice the dedication. Mine started with read a book yeah. every time. Every but time, I... Louise. Every time. Someone went that little extra mile, didn't they? <laughs> um, well, I, I thought you'd work that one out. Oh, gosh. <laughs> right, we have to... I'm worried about the bottom ones that won't get bit. I want that one. I want that one right there. I can't get it. I can't get it off. <laughs> oh, now I'm taking them all out. Uh, so that's one that wants. I'm no cheating. April. <laughs> April. April, okay. A book with a message of hope. Your favourite one. Now, hang on now. What? How will I know if it's hopeful before because I've read it? sometimes you must read reviews and things. I try not to read blurbs. No, but I think, I, okay. I think you'll... Because I think you don't... I'm not criticising, it was a question. No, well, I, you said don't make it too easy. No, I did. That's, so that was true. I'm only following No, you're following instructions. instructions. Right, okay. Want. January, February, March, May. Like April. Yeah, May, May or anything. I want that one. If I get my hand stuck in here, that would be awful. Can you imagine? The video I'd have to carry on in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> right. Eight. No. June. January, February, March, March April. April. No, no May. 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 A book published in your first decade. So a book between 82 and, and 92. 92. See, I, what, another one of the prompts that I'd given for you was the Read a book published in the year you were born. I, know, I, guess. I thought that was one that you got for your birthday month. It's not the one you got for month birthday month. You'll have to see that ever on my channel. Uh, <laughs> June. I'm going to go for that one. They just go quite 
quick, doesn't it? Yeah. It's quite fast. June, a novel featuring art or art. What? Art or, I don't like books about art. Yeah, well, you said to not make oh, it to... Oh, why can't this be in March? Because I could read a Kieran Lord Argraves and St Tom's book. There you go. But no, well, I can't because I've read it by yeah, I'm going to sulk, are you? I might, I might just... I thought that was a good I challenge. I might go back and refilm it. You oh, told no, me not to make it too channel. easy. No, 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 it's good. That's going to be tricky though, because I'm not... I've got a few suggestions. Well, I'm sure people will leave suggestions in the comments down below as well, which I will read. I don't always do them, but I will read them. <laughs> so what was that, June? Was it? Yeah. January, February, March, April, May, June. Yeah. July. We're halfway through the year now, which sounds quite spooky. I don't want the year to go to group. No. This is when I'm going to be on tour. And I won't be home for 15 weeks. Oh, it's good you'll have plenty to do. July. <laughs> with a sporting <laughs> slash games theme. Because I am very sporty. I'm renowned for really worth sporty fiction. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> From art to sport. I think we might be falling out. I'm not sure. I'm not sure our relationship no, no. will survive the next 12 months. That one got stuck so it won't come out. What we are now, June, July, August. August. A fictionalised life of a real person. Now, I like these kind of books. Can auto-fiction count if it's written by yeah. the author? Yeah, I think so. And I, well, you, one of your prompts was very similar, wasn't it? Yeah, about, um, I know you have to go and see. Oh, yeah. Mm. <laughs> I have to go and see to find out. Well, um, one, two, three, what one are we on now? I thought that was August, but I'm not sure. January, February. Do you know this problem with yours? No, I know. <laughs> it's because I'm a professional son. May, June, July, <laughs> August. We're on September. September when I'll be the final leg of my world tour round the British Isles. <laughs> and Northern Ireland. Okay. Ooh! Set within 20 miles of where you live. Yeah. Now, tell me where I'm living then. Because I'll be on no, tour. No, I meant where you live here. Okay, right. I did mean where you live here. Set within twelve. Well, I know what that one's going to be already. Oh. I know what that'll be. You might have changed my mind. No, September. I know because it's an author that I want to read again. I want to read more of their backlist, and it's set down the road. So I know what that one is. September, mm. September, October. Which one's that one? I can't remember now. October. Oh, no, I've lost it. I think it was that one. October. Yeah. A book that takes you to a country you really want to visit. Well, that would be Sri Lanka right now. I can't oh, no, drop enough. I'm going to be reading about Sri Lanka. Oh no, it might not be because I also really want to go to Japan. Oh. I really want to go to Australia, obviously. That's like my number one pick of anywhere I could go. Um, oh, that gives me a few places, but I suppose I should pick it now. No, I don't okay. think so. I think All right, then. October was November. Thank you. I just, I just can't get, I can't get the celebrities. May, July, just September, October, November. Don't call me a celebrity. <laughs> Um, November. Oh no, that was two. Oh no, I should have. That was one that I got. A family saga in November. Oh, I've got quite a few of those on my shelves. I, I love like family read. sagas. I like a family saga. I did have one in yours that you didn't get, so no spoiler really for the other video, which was narrated by a different sibling each cherry, uh, uh, alternating between different siblings. So we're on the same train of thoughts we with are, a few. Quite a few, yeah. Right, December. Come on, let's go to the one at the very bottom, which was. Oh no, is this the last one? Yeah. Oh. December. I'm going to be reading. A book written by a 40 year old. What could have made you think <laughs> of that? I can't. I, I don't know. Imagine. What could I can't possibly? Imagine. Who's 40 this year? <laughs> I'm 25. Are you all right with those? Yeah, they're good. I like this one. So is that one... Oh, I did do it that way, didn't I? So I've got to find a book with a Simon in for January. Mm. Ooh. And January is like literally mere days. Away. I find it very mm. weird that January in a whole new year is only at the end of this week. I know. I'm trying to think what I've read with Simon. No. The character's called Simon. Don't, don't you give too much away. Don't you give too much away. I'll, oh, I'm gonna go I'll look out the window whispering and stuff. <laughs> No, I think this is really good. And what we will do is um, I'll work out somewhere to create like an Instagram post where if you want to read along with, I've not thought of giving it a hashtag or anything like, I don't know, Savage Prompts. What do we call it? 24? The 24 Prompt 
the 24 Savage Prompts of 2022 is a bit of a long hashtag. It is, yeah. But, um, or just hashtag Savage Prompts. If you want to do my 12 that mum got, or the 12 that I've got from mum, or you want to do all 24, feel free. That would be lovely. Because I do think there's something really nice about taking a prompt. It's what I really loved about Book Hive Nation, is yeah. the prompts and going and looking through your shelves. It was just a bit too intense. I, I'm already mentally going through my shelves, thinking about whether I've got anything with a statue on the front. I'm already doing it. That's what I'm doing with Simon. Of course, I keep thinking of Piranesi, but I've read that. <laughs> yeah, you can. Well, that isn't... Only the columns. Yeah. Would you describe columns I think, as a statue? No, because there's the fawn, isn't there? It's is the he fawn. a statue? As, I thought that was him. No, no, he is a statue, the fawn. Oh. It's one in Pompeii. Oh, okay. Which actually you'd see... I'd quite like to go back to Pompeii at some point. Did you actually say day. that? Yeah, I would. I, told, I said this when we talked to Elsie Harper over on my channel, which I'm sure will be linked down below. <laughs> well, this has been lovely, Mum. Thank you yes, for my idea. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for your idea. Pleasure. And, um, and thank you for letting me record on your sofa. Yes, in a room that hasn't been recorded in before. No, with the purple backdrop. And so... Yeah, well, this was mum and dad's sofa, wasn't it? Your, your it was my grand, grand well, your mum and dad, and my grand yeah. bong. So, nice Gran read many a book on this. Oh, she certainly did. Many, she many. She also a did book. quite a lot of snoring as well. She also had many a Thorntons <laughs> on it. Yeah, and a glass of sherry. Yes. <laughs> All of the good things, basically. It's a lovely place to be. Yes. Anyway. I nearly finished your channel for you. No, it's your fine. video for you. I'm so, thank quiet. you very much for watching. Thank you very much for being my first guest on my channel. Pleasure. I've been pretty miffed at this someone else, won't I? Would you? Oh. Anyway, thank you very much. See you soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs>